make your name great. Yes. I will make you a great nation. Yes. I will bless them that bless you. And I will curse them that curse you. And in thee shall all the families of the earth be blessed. Yes. 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 All right, now. Okay. All you want to say that's Abraham? Yes. Galatians 3 and 29. Yes, sir. If he be Christ. Yes. Then I eat Abraham's seed yes. and heirs according to the promise. Galatians 3.13 yes. Christ became a curse for us yes. who knew no curse yes. that we might be redeemed from the curse of the law. Yes. The curse of the law is sickness. Yes. The curse of the law is poverty. Yes. But hear what? We don't want that prosperity gospel. Money is mentioned more than 500 and something times in the Bible. But they don't want, you could ask God for a job, ask God to save your children, ask God for a house, don't ask God for no money, you know. Like you commit the unpardonable sin, you're asking for money. But let me tell you something, money answer it all things. And not only that, I have heard that this ministry is doing work in Africa and probably India and other places. What do you all give them? A sheep? No. <laughs> and a goat? No. What do you all give them? A pound of butter? No. And some sugar? No. Amen. Amen. Money Amen. for missionary work. Yes. Money to do God's work. Yes. God has no problem with how wealthy we are. His problem is, as Deuteronomy 8 and 18 says, remember, don't forget, when I get you wealthy, that you serve your own hand. Remember. Fulfilled in Christ. Acts 13, 32 to 35. Yes. Amen. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Nothing is wrong. And I want to swing by here a little bit. You know why? Brethren in the church are struggling. You are you poor and hungry, and I hungry, and I care pay my rent. Who will go to the hungry brother? <laughs> oh God, trying to teach you something. That's why you keeping your poor. <laughs> when the Bible says that in this life, yes, parents and children, brothers and sisters. Houses and land. Yes. It is life. Yes. And in the world to come, yes. life everlasting. Yes. What part of that you don't understand? What God trying to teach we who grow up poor and hungry? He trying to teach you to be poor? Yes. What it is? So we chinks in. I don't know if you all know that word in Panama or Jamaica. Chinks and me need pulling back and a little bit of money. Chinks Right here. We don't want to pay. We don't want to bring our tithe into the storehouse. We don't want to sow seeds. We don't want to give arms. Amen. And we wonder why we don't have. May God have mercy. Because brethren, when you rich, and I stand up here and I cry, God, you know, because I can't tell you, because if the shoe look, and the foot look expensive, and I say she buy an expensive shoe and she can't pay she rent. <laughs> so I can't tell you. But I stand up and I cry, oh God, have mercy. Mercy. Mercy, Jesus. Mercy, mercy, Lord, oh God, mercy. Somebody with money, 
money, God will be able to talk to them. The library of the first sister. I don't know. But Jesus just tell me something. Yes. 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 He bless you. Hallelujah. But here will be like. Listen, I hear all your, I hear all your just satalamina delivered. I hear you guys just sing us something that I've not heard in another church, but a Trinidadian church. I hear you guys pull what we call some doption here. I never hear it in another church, but a Trinidadian church. Mm -hmm. What did the Jamaicans call you and you? Drill the back. Yeah. Amen. Glory to God. Yes, sir. And brethren, it is in times like those, hallelujah. Yes, sir. That the secrets are being revealed. Yes. 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 The healing is being revealed. Yes. The trouble is being revealed. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. Questions are being answered. Yes. It is in times like those, hallelujah. Ideas have been given. Yes. Doors have been opened. Yes. Hallelujah. Glory to God, brethren. Okay. Because God wants, yes. hallelujah, to work in our midst. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. While we sit quietly or while we sing or while I say we go down into the kutuya. Yes. Yes. God is still at work. Yes. 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 But my thousand dollars is too much to get past the carter. <laughs> so God talking. Mm. Yeah, they don't want to hear that. They don't want to hear God. <laughs> Amen. Yeah. When it comes to our money, we don't want to hear God at all. No. 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 When it is He that gives us yeah. money. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. Hallelujah, glory to God. Yes. Woman of God. The blessing of God is upon our lives. Yes. Amen. And since, not if, since the blessing of God is on our life, we have been blessed to be the head yes. and not the tail. Yes. Yes. We have been a blessed so that we will abide in Christ. Mm -hmm. And Christ will abide in us. Mm -hmm. That we will go and bring forth fruit. fruit yes. And that our fruit shall remain. Amen. Amen. We have been blessed. So that the greater works that Christ spoke about in John 14. Amen. He said you're going to do what I do. But you're going to do greater Amen. works. So it means hallelujah. Just as the woman with the issue of God, just as she tried to teeth a miracle, because that's what she tried to do. Teeth a miracle. Hoping that Jesus would know. Just so when you pass, and when I pass, somebody must be able to touch us. My Lord. Greater work. You must be able to touch you and receive a healing because of the anointing on your life. Yes. Amen. You didn't buy it in the 99 cent store. You didn't buy it for those who snub at people that shop at Bobby's. You didn't buy it by Lord and Taylor. <laughs> Amen. Amen. You didn't buy it here. My Lord. The Spirit of God. Mm -hmm. Upon you, your life. Yeah. Give it to you. Yes. So that you will walk in it. You will function in it. Yes. Because you claim your position. Yes. And you're ready now to mm -hmm. operate in yes. it. Yes. Yes. In that position. Yes. I do not know where you are today. But beloved, glory to God. 
to they have come to preach the acceptable year of God. And the acceptable year is the year of Jubilee. In Leviticus 25, that's the time when it says that if the brother was poor and he became a servant, you're supposed to set him free. That is the year of give back. The year of Jubilee. Amen. The year when the halves give to the half nuts. Amen. Amen. The year when the mm -hmm. help to bring the yes. Amen. Amen. The year of Jubilee. Yes. That's the year of wealth, yes. riches, and honor. Yes. Amen. Amen. Watch what God will do as you celebrate zealous woman in red. As you celebrate this weekend. The word of God comes to you today. It's not for you to be excited. Because excitement will get you nowhere. If you sing in the bathroom and you get excited and you go on the boys or one of them salmon cover will tell you go back in the bathroom. <laughs> Because you're excited. Okay? And a lot of folks come to the church to get excited. It is deeper than that. God has called us to put us in strategic places. God has called us to impact those that we are around and the societies in which we live. Once I thought salvation was just giving a life to God and not go to hell. That is all I understood. But when I come to understand, hallelujah, glory to God. Sister Betty, praise the Lord. When I came to understand that, I am not just nobody. Listen, I have it going on. <laughs> Because Jesus Christ is in me, Amen. the hope of glory. Yes. Yes. I've been called to lay my hands on the sick. Yes. Yes. And I have been told they shall recover. Yes. That's the word. Yes. And when I leave, I'm not wondering whether you recover or not. You That's know. right. Just I do what I do. Do it. That's it. Do it. Yes. Give, the rest, yes. give the rest to God. Yes. I do what I do. Yes. Your faith yes. will make you whole. Yes. And when we come to church, come expecting something. If you expect nothing, you wouldn't get nothing. Come expecting something. And come with a desire to meet with God. We come to see me for a little bit, sister Margaret, and see you too. I'm so happy that you come to me, come to live and see you. We're excited to see sister Margaret. But we're going back home sick. Yes. Yes. We're going back home hungry. Yes. Yes. Come to meet with Jehovah God yes. in the person of his son, yes. Jesus Christ. Yes. And brethren, as I conclude, Amen, first of all. I just want to say to us today that God loves us. Yes, yes he does. And in him, we have eternal security. Yes. Yes. Jesus said in John 10, 28 and 29, and I give you eternal life. And none can shall pluck you out of my hand. My father who is greater than I, yes. He gave you unto me, yes. and yes. none can pluck him, pluck us out of his hand. Brethren, your salvation is more than coming to church. Yes. Just as he didn't do nothing for the death sentence to pass on him, all you have to do is believe. Mm -hmm. And Jesus, listen, believe. Yes. So that when you become a child, you can't unsung you. Yes. True. And when your children can be bad like yours, you can't say they're not your children. They're yours. When you give your life to Jesus Christ, 
He ensures that he will bring you into eternity with him. Yes. It is not your works that will take you there. No. John 3 and 17 and 18, I believe, says that we shall be condemned because we do not believe on the name of the only begotten Son of God. You hear where your condemnation comes from? Not believing on the name of the only begotten Son of God. Yes. And you belong to royalty. Yes. Amen. You can live like a pauper if you want, but as your children. Yes. You can live in sickness if you want. Yes. That is your True. choice. True. Your healing has already been bought. Yes. It has already been paid for. Yes. Your eternity has already been secured. Yes. Know what the word of God says. Yes. And hold on to the word of God. Amen. May God bless you. And may God keep you. And for all those of you that are sick, that's, that receive your healing today, I want you to stand. Praise the Lord. All those of you who were sick that believe you receive your healing today, stand. You know why I'm asking us to stand? Because I want to caution us today. It doesn't matter what the doctor said. It doesn't matter what nobody asked you. Don't confuse the angel. I am healed. I am healed. I am healed. I am healed. I'm not going to do this long. Let me get some oil in the name of Jesus. Put it on my hand. Let me just pass it. Glory to God. Some people want to be touched. But the healing has already take place. Amen. Amen. Glory Amen. to God. Hallelujah. <laughs> Glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Praise the Lord. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Glory to God. Bless the Lord, oh my soul. And all that is within me, bless his holy name. Receive your healing in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing in the name of Jesus. Receive the healing in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. I declare that the spirit of healing is in the house. With the stripes of Jesus Christ, we are here today, not tomorrow, not next week, not next year, not next month. With the stripes of Jesus Christ, we are here, we are healed and go and walk in that healing in the name of Jesus. Walk in that healing in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus, walk in that healing. In the name of Jesus, I plead the blood of Jesus. I come up against the plan of the enemy to confuse you as to how the healing will take place. It is not for you to figure out. Hallelujah, glory to God. It is not for you to intellectualize. Hallelujah, glory to God. But it is for you to believe that God is able to do exceeding and abundantly above all he can ask and all that he can think in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord.
You see who I'm playing game, play game. I got my annual checkup. Yes. So that means I have to go and check out some things. Yes. Hallelujah. Yes. Yes. Fix some things. Yes. Usually when the blood work come back, the doctor will say, well, listen here, you have to change the sugar. You take it too much sugar, you take it too much salt. Yes. Press. This is what the annual does. Yes. Yes. They show like there's some kind of cancer or something, so we'll do further testing. Yes. Hello. Yeah. So if there is anything cancerous, I'm going to do further checkup. Oh, yeah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Some of us have some cancer thing in our body. Oh, yeah. in the I will come to distribute it in the church. Yeah. Glory. So we just got an annual checkup. Come on. Yes. Yes. It was not. It 
was set up for this very day. And how many years ago that was? About five years ago, you could say, or maybe more. About three? Look that. And I'm telling you, God set that up for this very day. I thank God for you. I thank God for the message that he gave you. Because sometimes we've got to pray the things that our mind has. And some people, like we would say, you know, we don't, we, some people sitting in there, all. And they act as if God is not a constant movement happening yeah. with him and it should be always the same way but today yeah. ah, today yeah. it is broken hallelujah so I pray God continue to bless you pastor I pray God let your ministry overflow in the name of Jesus With our hands. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Because yeah. as Pastor said today, they come for the feeling. Yeah. Yeah. And if the bishop comes today and says, We're not going to sing, we will pray and meditate. Yeah. Nah, church was boring today. Yeah. But if we sing and we hop and we skip and we do, my children are hot, you know. <laughs> but we have to know that some days God don't want all that. He just wants it to sit and be quiet so he can speak. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I thank God for today. I thank God for the entire weekend. We had a blessed weekend. God has been good. Amen. And we are now getting ready to send out some barrels and stuff to nursing homes, Panama, Bocas, and Jamaica. Bishop, I have to get that address from you again. And we are getting ready to move again because we always say that this woman in Red Weekend event the funds don't come to the church. That's the money that's used to do missionary work. Amen. We praise God. Praise the Lord. And we are a mission for God's people. Amen? Amen. So just pray our strength. Because you know, in doing good work, 